The world of science is one that never stays the same. With each new discovery, scientists learn more about our universe and what may be out there for them to explore. Each discovery demonstrates just how much remains unknown, and if we are lucky, new findings also provide clues that could help uncover even more secrets. The universe is an immense and fascinating place, but we still have so much to learn. That is why scientists are bravely forging forward to explore more of the unknown, and they are the reason we continue to uncover more mysteries every day. Whether we find these on our Earth or in outer space, we are constantly finding something new. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we're going to research and explore three recent discoveries. Enigmatic DNA strands named Borg's assimilate genes. Scientists have done it again. An American research team has discovered a group of enigmatic DNA strands, or Borgs, named after an alien group, that appeared in the television show Star Trek. According to Jill Banfield, a professor of microbial metagenomics, the name was chosen due to how the Borgs from Star Trek assimilated different species and cultures. That nickname proves to be a fitting one, as these mysterious strands of DNA assimilate genes from different organisms in their environment. This discovery, made in a Californian backyard, has the potential to explain more about the evolution of microorganisms and how they interact within their ecosystems. This structure of DNA consists of close to a million base pairs, and in their investigation, scientists discovered more secrets behind these borgs. More than half of the genes in their DNA sequence were new, and the structures seemed to be able to self-replicate due to having mirrored sequences at the end of each strand. Additionally, by looking into different DNA databases, scientists identified 19 sequences that resembled their discovery. Scientists have also noted that Borgs belong to a class of structures called extrachromosomal elements. These ECEs are found on the outside of chromosomes that contain most of the genetic material of an organism. ECEs tend to be large and self-replicating. However, the Borgs were found to be much larger than the average ECE, making these DNA strands even more mysterious. One of the most incredible aspects of this discovery is that Borgs happen to have a lot of the identical gene sequences from other microbes and elements. This makes nickname Borgs a fitting one, as researchers have interpreted their findings to mean that Borgs have assimilated these genes and elements. The broader implication of the Borgs remains unknown. Although the researchers speculated that they could have long-term biogeochemical consequences, such as reducing methane fluxes. If this is true, Borgs could play a role in important climate implications. With everything the researchers uncovered, the fact that these DNA strands were found in a Californian backyard just adds to this story's incredibility. China's U-2-2 rover beams back rugged images of the far side of the moon. Moving on to a recent space discovery is how China's U-2-2 rover has returned images of its more than three years of travel across the far side of the moon, known for its harsh environment. In these new images released by Our Space, a Chinese channel affiliated with the China National Space Administration, scientists received insight into the rover's three-year journey. The images show panoramic views of the far side of the moon's surface that were previously unseen because the moon's far side is not visible from Earth. Blocking visibility is the fact that the moon is tidally locked with Earth. On top of these groundbreaking images, one of the biggest stories to come out of this mission was when the Chinese team operating U-2-2 reported the sighting of a hut-like structure that led many people to believe that the mysterious object could be a crashed ship or an alien object. However, by nearing the structure, the team concluded it was just another lunar boulder. Despite this disappointment, this mission has been an incredible feat of scientific brilliance. U-2-2 landed on the far side of the moon in 2019 on top of the Chang'e 4 lander, making this pair the first spacecraft to land and operate on the hidden atmosphere of the moon. 
According to data from China's Lunar Exploration Ground Application System, since landing, the solar-powered U-22 has traveled more than 3,000 feet across the von Kármán crater. U-22 has made multiple discoveries during its mission, such as finding material that is potentially from underneath the Moon's crust, as well as glass spheres that were likely created by meteor impacts. U-22 and Chang'e lander have already surpassed their designed lifetimes of three months for U-22 and one year for Chang'e 4, making the mission even more of an incredible feat than originally expected. One of the reasons for this mission is because of the desire of many countries to reconquer the moon. Many researchers hope to send humans to these regions in the near future, and they have been studying the far side of the moon to make this hope a reality. Since the United States landed Apollo 11 on the moon in 1969, people have been fascinated by what else we may be able to discover in outer space. As much as the moon landing was an incredible step for mankind, we have yet to really explore even a fraction of the lunar surface. Future missions will no doubt be exhilarating for all of humanity. Liquid-filled canyons on Titan Another recent space discovery is how a team of researchers found that Saturn's largest moon, Titan, is full of deep, liquid hydrocarbon-filled canyons that make this large moon look almost like Earth. Titan is a cold and icy planet with rivers of methane, a far cry from our warm Earth that is filled with rivers of water. The research team has found that these canyons and channels on Titan form a network of rivers that they have named Vidflumina. These canyons are roughly half a mile wide and between 800 and 2,000 feet deep. Similar to how the Amazon River flows into the Atlantic, these rivers on Titan flow into its largest sea, Ligia Mare. While researchers know that these rivers are filled with liquid methane hydrocarbons, more research is needed to fully understand how the rivers flow. These observations would not have been possible without the data collected in 2013 by NASA's Cassini spacecraft that studied the topography of Titan. Yet, despite all of the information scientists have been able to uncover, most of the secrets of these canyons remain a mystery. Another mystery about these canyons is just how they were created. Canyons form on Earth due to erosion. This may not be the case on Titan, though. It is also possible that geological activities facilitated the creation of the canyons, but again, scientists cannot be certain. According to Valeria Poggiali, the lead author of the research paper that describes Cassini's finding on Titan, it's likely that a combination of these forces contributed to the formation of the deep canyons, but at present, it's not clear to what degree each was involved. What is clear is that any description of Titan's geological evolution needs to be able to explain how the canyons got there. Although scientists can theorize about the origins of Titan, there is still a lot to uncover. Adding more to the mysteries about this moon, scientists suspect Titan to be a potential area for alien life. They suspect this so much that there are plans for NASA to send an autonomous submarine to explore more of Titan. Despite the new data uncovered by the Cassini spacecraft, there is still much to learn about Titan, its canyons, and what they mean for humans on Earth, as well as the universe itself. Out there beyond our skies, and even sometimes in our backyards, there are constant discoveries that uncover mysteries that were previously incomprehensible to us. New discoveries continue to force us out of our comfort zone and make it clear just how much more exploring needs to be done before we even begin to understand what is around us. But what do you make of these recent discoveries? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.